Hey, hey, and welcome to 2 2 Tuesday. I'm in a different space. So welcome to my little green couch in my bedroom where I do my morning devotional. So I've got my books and Bible and this is a stuffed animal that Sydney gave me that she makes sure I keep close to me. So anyway, I actually put on shorts for you today. Oh my gosh, that's how much I love you. <laughs> okay, so because I'm going to share with you two tips on maybe looking a little bit more tan or less pasty. So my bronze friends, you might learn something here, but maybe not, I don't know, we'll see. All right, so first thing, first tip is our subtle tanning lotion, or if you're using another tanner, but the tip is before you use a tanning lotion, um, you should scrub first, scrub and exfoliate the dead skin cells. You want a smooth surface for your tanning products to go on. So, of course, we have the Shea Scrub. I love this stuff, the Revitalizing Shea Scrub. That's the official name. Okay, so it's in the white tea and citrus scent. But the idea is get all the dead skin cells off so there's nothing that the um, subtle tanning lotion is gonna like cling to because what you don't want is that uneven or like patches of dark. Okay, the other thing is when you put on your subtle tanning lotion, um, and of course our subtle tanning lotion is subtle. That is an important word for our tanning lotion. It is not Insta bronze, okay? <laughs> it is not, you just got a full out body, like I just went to the Bahamas for a week kind of look. It's subtle, it's more, um, mimics nature, where if you went out in the sun, you would get a little bit darker. If you put on another, you know, layer, you'll get a little bit darker. So basically the same way that you would sun, you don't have time to do that. You could progressively put on more layers, right? Day after day, every other day, whatever, until you get to a shade that you're happy with. So I like that part of it. But when you put it on, here's the, the kicker. You wanna put on in circular motions, starting in the middle of a limb, okay? So we tend to start on the bony parts, right? But on the bony parts, that's where the skin is more taut, it's gonna collect more. So start in the fleshy, bigger parts, circular, and then as you have less on your hands, you move to the bony parts. Same with your arms, you would start in the center and make your way to the wrist and make your way to the elbow. Okay, that's the tip for application. Here's another fun tip, oh my gosh. If you don't wanna mess with all that, I don't do it, <laughs> okay? I don't got time for that. Okay, so, but you're like, you just put on a pair of shorts and you're like, pasty legs, right? And you don't wanna worry about whole body, whatever, all this stuff, or you put on a dress. So these two products, this is our targeted action toning lotion. It would work with any lotion, I guess. And then CC cream in a much darker shade than you. So this is deep CC cream, much darker than Gina, okay. So then what I do is put lotion in your hand and then squirt the deep CC cream. Okay, that is not Gina's shade. But then you do the same thing. So I'm gonna take it and I'm gonna put it on. When you first put it on, you go, oh my gosh, no way. That's too dark. But you keep doing circular motions. Work it up, work it down. How much of the foot is gonna be seen, right? Keep working it in. This is just for that day. That moment when I'm wearing the dress and I don't wanna look like I have pasty legs, I can just put this on and not worry about, I don't care what my legs look like tomorrow, but today they're gonna to look nice, <laughs> right? And so then I don't have pasty legs. It almost looks like I have pantyhose on, right? So that is a fast trick to making a little bit tan, even look that's not pasty. So there you go, two, two Tuesday tips. Make it great.